Two died and 20 were injured as 100 vehicles were involved in crashes in fog on the M40 near Tame. 20,000 cars were caught up in the tailbacks which stretched for 15 miles. At dusk tonight, two police outriders lead commuters back onto the M40. This stretch of road finally reopened. It's taken 11 hours. This morning, a very different scene. Total chaos. There were only two vehicles involved in the first crash, but it triggered a series of accidents. Within minutes, more than 100 vehicles were involved in one collision after another. All this at the height of the rush hour on one of Britain's busiest roads. 12 miles of tailbacks, 20,000 drivers ground to a halt. Many had hours to wait and no escape. It's now, what, up past 10 now, so it's over three and, like, three and a quarter hours we've been here. You know, and, uh, well, we just sit and wait. It's about two and a half hours so far. You just thank your lucky stars you're not caught up in what's further along. Even the rescue teams had difficulty reaching the scene. There were two fatalities here, including the motorcyclist involved in the initial crash. There was heavy fog this morning, but police say motorists were driving too fast and too close. Police have spent all day here trying to clear the wreckage. This is just one truckload of cars. There were 20 separate collisions here. But it wasn't the only motorway disrupted today. There was mayhem too on the M5 in Somerset. A lorry smashed through the central reservation into oncoming traffic. It careered down this embankment, taking a car.